Hello everyone, welcome back to the Storm 33. I am Tatiana. I'm here with some summons, but I'm just gonna read it to y'all. I'm not in the mood, okay? This is titled Deshromedy Chapter 18 in the Old Testament. Deshromedy stands for review. Let's begin. The priestess, the Levites, all the tribe of Levi shall have no portion nor inheritance with Israel. They shall eat the offerings of the Lord made by fire in his portion. Who? All of them, they should go to hell, basically what that means. They shall have no inheritance among their brothers. Who? Like they say, there's no caskets in hell, no bump beds in hell or something like that. The Lord is their inheritance, and he has spoken to them. This shall be the priests due from the people, from those who offer a sacrifice, whether it be ox or sheep, that they shall give to the priests the shoulder, the two sheets, and the inner parts. Who, the first fruits of your grain, of your new wine, and of your oil, and the first of the fleece of your sheep, you shall give him. For the Lord your God has chosen him out of all your tribes to stand to minister in the Lord's name, him and his sons forever. Y'all just look at the screen, okay? It's going to pop up, okay? If a Levite comes from any of your gates out of all Israel where he lives as a foreigner and comes with all the desire of his soul to the place where the Lord shall choose, I don't think that by me. Then he shall minister in the name of the Lord, his God. Okay, that is by me. As all his brothers, the Levites do, who stand there before the Lord. They shall have like portions to eat in addition to that which comes from the sale of his family possessions. Who, when you have come into the land which the Lord your God gives you, you shall not learn to imitate the abominations of those nations. I didn't. There shall not be found with you anyone who makes his son or his daughter to pass through. The fire, one who loses divination, one who practices sorcery, or an enchanter or sorcerer. Yes, I still do it, okay? Or a charmer or a counselor with a familiar spirit. Yes, or a wizard or a niche, a necromancer. A necromancer is somebody that brings up the dead. For whoever does these things is an abomination to the Lord. Because of these abominations, the Lord, your God, drives them out from before you. You shall be perfect with the Lord, your God. For the, nation, for the nations that you shall depossess, listen to those who practice sorcery and to diviners. But as for you, the Lord, your God, has not allowed you to do so. Who? The Lord your God will raise up to you a prophet from among you of your brothers like me. You shall listen to him. That's a negative. This is according to all that you desire of the Lord your God in Horeb in the day of the assembly, saying, Let me not hear again the Lord my God's voice, neither let me see this great fire any more, that I not die. Okay, um, yeah. The Lord said to me, They have real said that which they have spoken. They show the. I don't like to do these summons at night, but yes, um, you know, I got touched today. You know what I'm saying? I will raise them up, a prophet from among their brothers, like you. I will put my words in his mouth, and he shall speak to them all that I shall command him. Who they agents, but it's still they heart, you know. I got some other summons like that too. It's they heart though. They letting they letting them lose them. So I don't feel no way. It shall happen that whoever will not listen to my words, which he shall speak in my name, I will require it of him. But the prophet who speaks a word presumptuously in my name, which I have not commanded him to speak, or who speaks in the name of other gods, that same prophet shall die. I did. A couple of me. I'm just, I just got a lot of lives. 
You may say in your heart, how shall we know the word which the Lord has not spoken? He cannot talk. I don't understand how, I, I don't understand why I got to keep explaining that. Like, I just, I don't know. I'm going to explain it at this, but like, I just don't understand why people are so dense, you know? And people say I'm slow and I'm autistic. At least I understand what's going on, though. Even they try to make it like I don't. When a prophet speaks in the Lord's name, if the thing doesn't follow nor happen, that is the thing which the Lord has not spoken. The prophet has spoken it presumptuously. Yes, you shall not be afraid of him. And they is. I just don't get it. Y'all not scared of the other motherfuckers, but y'all scared of the most high? Like, come on now, like, in 1994, the world got sacrificed, okay? My daughter was sacrificed. That was, because they stole God, okay? They stole God machine to sacrifice my daughter, to take over the world. I don't know how many times like, I got to tell y'all that. And when you take over the world like that, that's an ultimate sacrifice. When you take over the world like that, it's going to be a while until the shit is over, you know? Frenny, Frenny, it was over. Okay? So they sacrificed my daughter to gain the world. And I somehow stayed with them. Okay? Because that's what God's revenge was. His revenge was for me to be with them all through their days. Which was also explaining in this fucking chapter. And it's just like people just afraid of this man, of, of him. I know God, you know, don't fear no man but God, okay? He a man, okay? But y'all worshiping a God, a spirit. You worshiping this. No offense, God, but goddamn, I be scared of you. The fuck I would go to him. Like, he look regular, okay? He deformed, okay? They did that to him. Damn, how many times I got to explain that? They the one who did that to him. I told y'all, back in the day, he was he let us lose his powers. Okay, I know that sound dumb, but oh, what the fuck? It say that. It's what God, this one did. You see what they done did? Like, uh, come on now. Like, they, they, they deformed him and turned him into Candyman. Okay? Candyman, Bloody Mary, God, whatever. Okay, so what? They deformed him. You scared of him. Y'all scared of them. Y'all have to go to Shanice and Gina. Okay? And God, whatever, okay? I have to go to him. That's on my wall. Uh, the him right there. Right here. Right here. Him. Right there. Y'all see him on the screen? I have to go to him. I just don't understand how people is just so fucking slow and stupid and dense. Now half of y'all family members gone because of y'all actions. Y'all can't blame that shit on me, bro. That was y'all actions. Y'all did that shit. Y'all the one who doing death spells. You the one who come into a person, private home, to attack them with something that scares them. Yes, the Bible scares me. Yes, this man scares, scares me. Yes, his people scares me. Okay? That, but that don't mean you got to put, you, you, you put in fear in me. I don't give a fuck if y'all ain't listening, but that that's just not cool, bro. And now you getting your own people killed. You getting your own people not the fuck off because of your actions, bro. Just go ahead and stay with them, which you is, bro. I don't understand how people, people, oh, they can, okay. The people going to act like, okay, I can just leave and I can cleanse myself and I can do a yanny bath and I won't be, I won't get caught. I got fake lawyers on my team. I got fake cops on my team. I'm not going to get caught. Trust me, baby, you done got caught. You caught red-handed. All y'all, all y'all that came, always coming in my private home when I'm finna walk. Telling your kids bad stuff about me. Your bad kids doing fucking death spells. Now your whole family lineage gone, bitch. Half of them any goddamn way, like I see. Is you done, though? Is y'all done, though? I think not. Enjoy.